So, uh, I have a news story here that is just ridiculous. I was going to share one that was slightly inappropriate, but I love this one because uh, there's a new safety crossing in um, Gloucestershire County. Uh, anyway, uh, it's supposed to help the blind cross uh, the street or go, you know, to different places because it's raised bumps in the road and they can walk along it. Very easy. Uh, unfortunately, they weren't really planning very well, and it goes straight into a plate glass window. Mm. <laughs> so, it it so. was, and the best part is, it was installed as part of a 5.5 million pound uh, project mm. to uh, link the docks with the city city structure. It's supposed to be a safety uh, thing. It's supposed to be a, a safety project. <laughs> so, there's all these people that are just like, oh, I guess I'll follow this. Bam! <laughs> and I know it's not funny to laugh about that, but it is no, funny to... No, it is. It's funny uh, to laugh. Oh, okay. sure. oh. So, so here's here's the other part of it. So apparently the reason it leads to a shop is because it was supposed to direct the blind to shops. There you go. Uh, unfortunately, uh, they did not read the blueprint on where the door was supposed to be. That's uh, what happened. Now... Uh... And it's just it, all it would take is looking at the blueprint, you know. You just have to look. You have to check. That's it. I don't know. Oh, well, I just like the least. fact that I'm like, does it say what type of shop it goes uh, to? It looks like it is a furniture store. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it it's a furniture exhibition center. Hmm. Now. <laughs> I do have a secondary one, because I realized that one was more pathetic than actually funny. Do you mind if we go for two? I liked it. I liked it. Okay, do you mind if we go for two? All right, let's go for two. Yeah. So, you know Sheryl Crow, the uh, the singer? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah. She has said to everybody that she has talked to, she's starting this campaign to use one piece of toilet paper per visit to the restroom. I don't know why she decided to make this a stand, and most people are kind of confused. Except on, quote, those pesky occasions where two or three could be re required. Hmm. She, she is trying to, you know, take a stance on climate change, but I think toilet paper is sort of the wrong place to start with that. I don't... Oh, hmm. she, she has also designed a clothing line to get rid of uh, paper napkins that has a detachable dining sleeve that uh, wearers can use to wipe their mouth while eating. What? Yes, detachable dining sleeve. It sounds so useful. List. Yes. <coughs> well, this... I suppose it, it would work really well for those germaphobes. Zin, 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 think about this this way. You just wipe something out with your sleeve, and now it's just touching you all day. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. All it's, day. It's detachable for washing. This sounds like a great way to either make someone lose their germ phobia or go mad. Oh. All right. Shall we call oh. it here? Sure. Unless you unless you mind if I bring one more up. All right. So this one is art related. I always have to have at least one art related thing. Mm -hmm. So patrons thought a stabbing was a part of an art uh, basal. I show. heard about this. You heard about this? Okay. So it. This is once again Florida. There you go. Miami Damn Beach. It. Damn it. A woman pulled an exacto knife and stabbed another woman in the arms and neck. <laughs> oh, God. We're reaching <laughs> that point now when the person's screaming and bleeding. Oh, this is an interesting movie. I thought a piece of art fell on her or something like that, but it was. It was uh, I think it's just super embarrassing for that guy who thought it was a part of the art exhibit or the people that stood around going, Was that supposed to happen? I, I don't. You know. and I think that's my biggest problem with performance art is that. It You're never sure. That You're they live through the end of it. Yes, they did. They're fine. No, uh, never mind. Eh? Uh, 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 this is the slow burn one. <laughs> oh. So Here's the funny thing about it, though. Is I, I'm just imagining, because the artist was there, too. And they're like, why would you think I would do this? <laughs> <laughs> so just, is, it, is it he or she that made it? Uh, I think it's a she. Give me a moment. Let me check. Uh, I, I I'm sorry if you hear anything from my side, but there's someone outside honking their horn, and I don't know why. No, no, I don't hear You're anything. Like, Podcast, woo! No, no, woo! So I'm just I'm just imagining like the artist is sitting on the ground. The police are like, "We're very sorry this happened." 
and they look up at the police and go, it was brilliant. Funny thing is, is that they had, um, it was for a Friedman Fitzpatrick gallery, and people just thought it was a performance art at first. Cause, and looking from the things that are on the walls around them, it looks to be framed black squares. I'm not going to judge art, because, <laughs> you know, I've seen some things that look simple at first, but actually weren't, things like that. But I just want to say, these appear to be wooden framed black squares, and in one case, a white square. Hmm. Um... I don't know. Don't you understand it, Rusty? Don't you get it? I do get it, and I get that they're trying to communicate something poorly. Um, Mm, mm. Fighting words. Ow. Uh, 